Again, welcome to the session. Let us discuss the following question. The question says in each of the following exercises 1 to 6, find the coordinates of the focus. Axis of the parabola, the equation of the directrix and the length of the latest vector. Given equation of parabola is y squared is equal to 12x. Before solving this question, we should know that what is meant by a parabola. A parabola is the set of all points in a plane that are equidistant from a fixed line at a fixed point in the plane. The fixed line is called the directrix of the parabola and fixed point, let's say F, is called focus of the parabola. A line through the focus and perpendicular to the directrix is called axis of the parabola. The point of intersection of parabola with the axis is called the vertex of the parabola. Now, latest right term of a parabola is a line segment perpendicular to the axis of the parabola through the focus and whose end points lie on the parabola. This is the latest right term of the parabola. Now we are going to learn about standard equations of parabola. Now look at this figure. If the parabola has vertex at the origin, focus at the point A0 and directrix x equals to minus A, then equation of parabola is of the form y squared equals to 4ax. Now look at this figure. If the vertex of the parabola is at the origin, focus at the point minus A0 and directrix x equals to plus A, then equation of parabola is of the form y squared equals to minus 4ax. Now look at this figure. If the vertex of the parabola is at the origin, focus at the point 0a and directrix y equals to minus a, then equation of parabola is of the form x squared equals to 4ay. Now look at this figure. If the vertex of the parabola is at the origin, focus at the point 0 minus a and directrix y equals to a, then equation of parabola is of the form x squared equals to minus 4ay. So always remember these four equations of parabola. We can conclude from the standard equations of parabola that if equation of parabola has y squared term, then axis of symmetry is along y, sorry, x-axis. And if the equation of parabola has x squared term, then axis of symmetry is along y-axis. Now, when the axis of symmetry is along the x-axis, then the parabola opens to the right if the coefficient of x is positive, and parabola opens to the left if the coefficient of x is negative. When the axis of symmetry is along y-axis, then the parabola opens upwards if the coefficient of y is positive, and parabola opens downwards if the coefficient of y is negative. Keeping all this in mind, let's now begin with the solution. Given equation of parabola is y square equals to 12x. We have learned that if equation of parabola has y square term, then the axis of symmetry is along x axis. Now here, the given equation involves y square. So the axis of symmetry is the x axis.
we have also learned that if coefficient of x is positive then parabola opens to the right now here coefficient of x is positive so the parabola opens to the right now the given equation y square equals to 12x can be written as y square is equal to 4 into 3 into x. Now this equation is clearly of the form y square equals to 4ax. So comparing y square equals to 4 into 3 into x with y square equals to 4 ax we get a as 3. We have learnt that if equation of parabola is y square equals to 4ax then its coordinates of the focus are of the form a0 and equation of directrix is of the form x equals to minus a. Now here the equation of parabola is of the form y square equals to 4ax. So focus of this parabola is a0 and here a is equal to 3. So focus of this parabola is 3, 0. Equation of directrix is x equals to minus 3. Now we will find length of latest right term. Length of latest rectum is equal to 4 times a. Now here a is equal to 3. So length of latest rectum of this parabola is 12. So coordinates of the focus are 3, 0. Axis. of parabola is x-axis directrix is x equals to minus 3 and length of the latest rectum is 12. This is our required answer. So this completes the session. Bye and take care.